Meet the farm team. Daisy the dog. Pa on the quad. And Kip and Finn. Two brothers who love the farm. Out comes the big red tractor. We've got a very busy day on the farm with lots of hungry animals to be fed. Pa is using the tractor to lift two big straw bales. right -o, to the paddock we go, where some hungry cows are waiting for their breakfast. The bale goes down and the cage gets lifted over top. This stops the cows from getting into the straw and making a mess on their food. Kip and Pa cut the string and pull it off the straw bale. We wouldn't want any of the cows swallowing it and getting it stuck in their tummies. Mmm, the cows will love this straw. Let's go check that the trough is full of clean water. Ah, it looks good. But it is a bit muddy around the trough. We'll come back later with some gravel and fix it. But for now, let's get back to feeding the animals. Don't worry, Kip. Pa will help us close the gate. This is called a cocky gate, and it can be pretty tricky to close. Time to take the forks off the front of the tractor. And next, let's attach the bucket. This is where Clarabelle, the cow, and the goats live. We'll take both the drums and fill them with food. This is a mix of oats, lupins, and barley. Okay, watch your toes. Watch your fingers. Mm. Alright, now we're right. 
Can you carry it? Or is it too heavy? Kip loves helping to feed the goats and he's so excited for you to meet them too. Looks like they're happy to see us. The big white goat at the front. Her name is Pumpkin. When she first came to the farm, she was a baby goat called a kid. Now she is a mummy goat called a nanny and she has lots of cute little babies of her own. and off to the gravel pit. We're going to scoop up a really big bucket of gravel. Let's head back out to that muddy trough. and then uses the bucket to smooth it all around the trough. gravel pit, we're going to need another big bucket of gravel.
boots to help compact the gravel. around the trough anymore. Now Pa is digging a big long trench so the water can drain away from the trough and into the bushes instead. Take this bucket off and put on a different bucket. This drum goes some oats. Can I see? Ah, oh, from up there. There you go, Kip. Some oats for the goats. And some oats for the sheep. Ma! The wheat comes all the way down. We've got some more cows that need feeding. Let's fill this bucket up. This is called a self-feeder. The grain will come out as the cows are eating it. Hey Finn. Hey Kip. That's the feeding trailer. Pa is hooking it up to the back of the ute. Back to the truck. We need more grain. Up we go to the paddock. Hey sheepies! These sheep are happy to see us. They know we've got grain to feed them. There is a rope attached to that trailer. Pa pulls the rope as he's driving. 
Then the grain drops onto the ground for the sheep. What a day! The animals got fed and we had so much fun! Thanks for joining us! Bye! Bye! See you!